I spent years trapped as a junior developer, not because I didn't know how to code, I could write functions. I understood loops, conditionals, data structures. I'd finished dozens of courses, but I was still stuck, and I didn't understand why until I realized the one thing I'd never done. I'd never shipped a real project. I'm talking about a project that wasn't a tutorial, a project where I had to figure out the requirements myself, a project where things broke in ways the tutorial never mentioned and I had to fix it anyway. That's the difference between a junior developer and someone who's actually growing. And most juniors never cross that line. Here's what I mean. When you're doing tutorials, everything is laid out. The instructor tells you what to build, how to build it, the exact steps. It's safe, it's comfortable, and it teaches you almost nothing. Because real development is chaos, unclear requirements, users who want features you didn't plan for, bugs that only happen in production. You can't learn that from a tutorial. You can only learn it by doing. But most juniors never ship. They're terrified. They think their project has to be perfect, original. So they never start. Or they quit halfway because it's not as polished as the apps they use daily. You're comparing your first project to apps built by teams over years. But that's not the point. The point is you're learning things you can't learn any other way. When I finally shipped my first real project, it was terrible. The code was a mess. The UI looked like it was designed by someone who hates users. About three people used it, and one of them was my mom. But I learned more from that one project than I did from six months of tutorials. Because I had to figure out deployment, error handling for cases I didn't expect. I had to read documentation for libraries that didn't have tutorials. I had to debug issues Google didn't have answers for. And all of that made me better. Employers don't care about tutorial projects. They care if you can solve problems. If you can take something from idea to working product, the only way to prove that is by showing them something you built and shipped, something you made decisions on, something you debugged, something real. But I don't have an idea. You don't need one. Build a to-do app. Build a weather app. Build a clone of something you use. It doesn't matter. The value is in going from zero to deployed, in all the things that break and figuring out how to fix them. That's what turns you from someone who knows syntax into someone who can build things. The other thing juniors do is build locally and never deploy. They'll spend weeks perfecting a project on their laptop and leave it there. That's almost as bad, because deploying is where you learn the hard lessons. Environment variables, QRS, databases that work differently in production, SSL certificates, and DNS. Those things separate juniors from people who actually ship. So here's what I want you to do. Stop watching tutorials for a month. Pick one project. It doesn't have to be impressive. It doesn't have to be original. It just has to be something you build from start to finish and deploy. Put it on the internet, even if it's broken, even if it's ugly, even if nobody uses it. Because finishing something and putting it out there will teach you more than another React course ever will. And here's the thing about shipping. Once you do it once, it gets easier. The first project is terrifying. The second one is uncomfortable. By the third one, you start to feel like you know what you're doing. And that's when you stop being a junior. Not when you finish your 10th course, not when you memorize every JavaScript method, but when you can take an idea, build it, and ship it without needing someone to hold your hand. Now let's get to the sponsor of this video, Savala. Savala is a modern platform as a service that takes care of the boring, time-sucking infra stuff so you can focus on building. You get fully managed services, Git-based deploys, and no surprise bills. It's fast, reliable, and comes with support from real devs who know what you're dealing with. Most platforms charge extra just for that, Savala doesn't. And here's what's crazy. Many of their clients, like Stepler, cut cloud costs by 78% by letting Savala handle the infrastructure. Try it out with $50 free credit, link below. Thanks for watching.